All right, guys, we're back to part 50 of the Witcher 3 Wild Time. Part 50. You're probably wondering why is there no fight. I actually was just recording this, and in the middle of it, my camera turned off on its own. The stand turned it off. Wow, oh, I'm pissed too. Let her decide. But I'll try and run into some action. She's incapable of deciding anything just now. A dark spell, it must be. Help her, Witcher. I beg you. This is no dark spell, I'm afraid. Well, what is it then? She's been through a lot. Lost a child, was carried off by a fiend, lived in the Crone's village taking care of children who are now gone. It's left its mark. As it would on anyone. So it's hopeless. You can't help her. She's to be like this. I'm sorry. I know a hermit. A very wise man with a gift for healing. Met him some time past. Lives in the Blue Mountains. I shall take her there. Might be worth a shot. I shall go with you. That's impossible, suddenly. Why? You have duties. Duties deriving from your commitment to the Church of the Eternal Fire. Once we finish our work in Velen, we return to Oxford. You said you'd save my mother. And I kept my word. Your father can care for her now. He you care? You know him. You know what he did to her. He swears to be a changed man. And in his eyes I see true sorrow. Remorse for his sins. He will care for her. And you've a new life and new duties to the eternal fire. Fear not. All will be well. I will not touch drink. I will find the hermit. And once she is herself again, we will find you. I swear it. You have my word, child. Man, the visuals for this game, though. I like it. I like how they a little bit unmoderize unmod uh, it, you know? Witchers were made to kill monsters. It Ooh. doesn't matter who posted the notice. The coin has to be right. That's all. Witchers don't debate. Their conscience plays no part. They just get on with it, then pick up the coin pouch tossed at their feet and set off on their way. Folk don't expect witchers to save them from themselves. Thank you, witcher. Despite all. May the eternal fire guide and protect you. Farewell. Quest complete.
Let's test it out this time. Okay, so we just got done examining a crime scene, <clears throat> a murder. I want to call it a crime scene, even though, because that's the modern day now. And I'm sure they might have used it in this fantasy world. Um, but we got to go travel and talk to the car owner. But uh, Roach was just here drinking his water. But now it's time to go again. Hope you had enough. And if not, we can get more when we stop. Alright, here we go. There we go. Geralt, right? I'm glad you're here. Held off on the autopsy till you arrived. Nice of you. Especially given you didn't seem pleased about my previous visit. Because you came unannounced and in unfortunate company. I also had Reverend Nathaniel to contend with. Our spiritual caretaker has left the city on some important matter. And I know who you are, what drives you. I'm more than happy to aid your investigation. Start. Gladly. The wounds conform to the killer's modus operandi. The victim was bound and forced to drink formaldehyde. Next, the killer removed the eyes, placed burning coals in the sockets, then opened the rib cage. And... What's this? A parchment made of human skin. A message from the murderer. The name of his next victim. Patricia Vagelbird. Gods. He knows no bounds. To attack Lady Vagelbud, heiress of such a prominent family. Where is she? Tell me. She resides in an estate beyond the city, north of Oxenford. Gotta find her, now. Yeah, get down. Now we gotta go to the. Gotta travel all the way there. I'll skip the traveling. What are your woods? Need to talk to Patricia Vagelbud. You think any bum off the street can. Her life's in danger. Let me in or have her blood on your hands. If you thought this up, and I'll let you in, I'll throw my ass out the door. Always thought a guard was supposed to protect his charge, not his ass. So be it. I'll take you to Lady Vagan, bud. Just no trickery. Understand? Yes, good fellow? If it's work you seek. Don't know that I'm all that good. Name's Geralt. Looking for Patricia Vagelbud. Her life's in danger. In danger? Come now. I saw mother this morning. She seems sad, true, but in perfect health. I'm hunting a serial killer, and I've got reason to believe your mother will be his next victim. Why, even if it's true, our gods. He's exceptionally cruel when he kills. Cruella. Have, have you guys seen that movie yet? I have not. Just in case. Too many live-action Disney remakes. I think at this point there's more live-action than animated, which is getting out of hand. I mentioned mother seems sad. Do you remember? In fact, 
She's in the midst of a crisis of faith. A rather serious one. We'd been to know you by Mother had seen the pies in High Rock Square. Uttered not a word on her way home. She had all the home books, insignias, reliquaries gathered, taken outside and burnt. Then she locked herself in her room. We need to hurry. Well, well, another freak. Mother's certainly not in the mood for guests. Oh! He, he ran out the other door! Catch him! Bruh. Shit. I can't fucking run! That it? What's going on? Halt! Or I'll put a bolt between your eyes! Listen, you got the wrong guy. Save your trickery, taking you to the heiress. <sighs> well, killer's already escaped. Lead the way, hero. Bro, what are you doing? Might have gotten bored of whores and beggars. I don't know. Too early to draw any conclusions. Ingrid, I know this is a hard time for you, but usually the killer leaves a note on the body. A note indicating his next victim. May I? Very well. But you should be on your own. I do not wish to see her in this state. I do not wish to remember her like that. And let her be the last victim, please. Bruises, broken fingers. Well, more nudity. She defended herself. Must be why it took him longer, and why he almost got caught. Here it is, sweet Nettie, crippled Kate's. Growing bolder, not just the name, but the place too. Won't get away this time. Find an idiot to cripple his neck. I think I'm gonna do that in the next video. Um, I'm gonna end the video right here, and then we're gonna do part 451 when we're on the run. So, yeah, bye.